my kicks, me and my kicks, me and my, me and my, me and my kicks, me and my kicks, me and my kicks, me and my, me and my kicks. What is going on YouTube? It's your favorite YouTuber, me and my kicks, and I want to wish you guys a happy Memorial Day. If you had the day off, if you're working and getting that time and a half overtime, if you're barbecuing, whatever, man, I just want to wish you guys a happy Memorial Day, and I hope you guys get a chance to enjoy it to the fullest. Since it's Memorial Day, you already know for the weekend, like a lot of stores be like throwing all types of deals, sales, etc., going on. And the Nike outlet stores, they're doing an additional 30% off all footwear. Also, Adidas is doing an additional 30% off all footwear. So you know I had to go ahead and check it out and do a vlog on it, man. So if you like any shoes that's in the video, hit that thumbs up. Also, comment down below what's the best shoe you've seen in this video. If you picked up any shoes on sale for Memorial Day weekend, it could have been in the outlets, online, in another store, whatever. Just comment that down below and we can chop it up in the comment section. Also, if you aren't subscribed to the channel, what are you doing, man? Hit that subscribe button. It takes nothing but a couple Couple seconds and you'll be notified of when I drop future videos. Now enough talking, let's get into this vlog. I never even heard of these before. No they call these the Vapor Max Premier Fly Knits. They got like a multi-colored upper. It's pretty decent. I mean, it's kind of crazy, but retail 220, they got them at 110 plus 30% off, make it like 70 bucks. You can't beat that at all. Nice little detail on the back. It didn't take long for these flight pauses to hit the outlet. They got them at 120 plus 30% off discount, making like 90, 100, or 90 or 80 bucks. So, got a nice little size run in these. Got the all red uh, Air Force One high foam posit. These all red and they're foam. Um, Pain 82 will go crazy over these, man. I'm surprised they ain't got like three of these, but with the discount, make them like 80 bucks, so not a bad price. These things still sticking around at outlets. Got them for 60 bucks plus 30% off, make them like 40. That's not bad at all. Nice little size run in these too. They got the Forrest Gump uh, Cortez's for 60 plus the 30% off, make them around like 45-ish, 40 bucks. That's not bad. And they also got these orange Air Force Ones. I always wanted these shoes, and this is the first time I'm seeing them, so uh, retail was 100, they got them at 80. So mark down, it'd be like 55. Plus tax make it 60. I'll go ahead and grab these. I don't know, for some reason, it's just this orange that really popped to me. Got these Adidas Young Ones for 100 bucks plus 30% off, make them 70. They got a whole bunch of Young Ones. They got these, got these. They also got some all black, all gray joints. So they got a lot of, uh, of the newer releases out here at the outlet. This is a nice colorway in the Continental 80s. Nice burgundy of gold for about $40 after the discount. Got a navy and gold. Remind me of the lost uh, St. Louis Rams for basically 40 bucks as well. Here's the first steal of the day. Got the Ultra Boost for the 19s actually for 110 or 126 plus 30 percent off. Make them about like 90 bucks. Can't beat that for the Ultra Boost 19s. And I heard they got pretty decent comfort. They got the Oreo versions of it. They also got the white and black version. So. To catch these for under 100 bucks is definitely a nice little price. For the ladies, they got all the flavors in the Ultra Boost 19s. They got the gray with the black. They got the black with the white. They got the pink with the white. Pretty nice right here. They got the navy with the white. They got the tan with the white. They even got the pink gray with the white. They going crazy. Here go those little patchwork uh, blazers. Uh, I showed these white ones in my other vlog, but I ain't see the uh, low black ones. These pretty decent as well. And they also got these LeBrons. These are LeBron 16 lows. They made this after when he got drafted with the um, Cavaliers. And these are okay, but I would never buy them. Then they got these Superman reverses or regular Supermans. They just doing too much with the Superman stuff. They should have just stuck with the threes and let it alone. They go 11 low snake skins. And hand, I thought these would be a little bit better. Like, I thought these would be way better in person, but. And hand these, I don't know, these don't look too right. The pink ones was the best ones out of this little snakeskin pack. Looking at the bottom, got that milky clear also. Eh, not really a big fan. At Athlete's Foot, they got these gel light threes. I like these. These kind of remind me of like Georgetown Hoyas. Well, 110 for them. A little bit too much in my opinion, but I'm going to definitely be on the lookout for these. 
glad I was able to run past these today. A6 never seems to amaze me, man. They always got some different type of colorway going on. I like these too. It's like a light, like dookie green with the gold hits. He's not bad. I'm guessing these just came out because they retail. Got to get these for a little bit lower though. They also got like a white and gold version of them. It's pretty decent as well. I don't know if um, athletes feel selling these early or what, but they got them out on display just to look at. So here's the Ray Allen 7s. I'm not really a big fan of 7s, and I'm definitely not a big fan of this colorway. So eh. they go to uh, Nike Zoom Rookie um, Memphis Tiger colorway. I thought this was okay. I wish this blue was a little bit darker. This would be cold then, but I'm not mad that they had to go ahead and do the Memphis Tiger on this colorway as well, on this silhouette as well. Over here they got the Kobe One Pro Trolls, the white, red, and black ones for 139 plus 30 percent off. Make them around like 80 bucks, 90 bucks, and they also got the I forgot the name of these, but they got these as well for the same price. So a nice little steal over here at the um, Wisconsin Outlets. Nice little size run and all of it too. We got the Westbrook 10s over here for 140 plus the discount. Make them like 80, 90 bucks. That's not bad for these. And they also got the chlorophylls for 120 plus the discount. Make them around like 80 bucks as well. Nice little steal and they got a nice little size run and all of it. I never seen this colorway in the 312s. They got like a cool gray type colorway. Got these for 100 plus 30% off, make them like 70 bucks. You rarely see these at the outlet. They got the Carmelo 1.5 with the little like Python backing. These was not, these not a bad colorway. 110 plus the discount, make them like 70 bucks. It's not bad at all. And it's my first time like seeing these in person. Not bad quality. They got the glow in the dark Nike Zoom rookies for 129 plus the discount. Make them um, what, 70, 80 bucks? That's not bad for these. 80 bucks for them and retail was 210 can't beat that at all and they got a nice little size run of it i never seen this colorway in the nike air max pluses but i'm not really a fan of this especially since it got like that big nike with the little nike really throws off the shoe in my opinion but yeah they got these for 104 plus a discount make them like 70 bucks you can't beat that though got these oreo uh air max 98s i never seen this colorway before got it for retail plus 30 percent off so it'll be like 110 after uh, taxes and everything. Not a bad colorway though. They got the uh, DB15s here and like the bigger sizes like 10 and up. Uh, got this for retail plus 30% off. So they'd be like 120-ish, 130-ish. I always wanted this shoe, but I didn't want to pay retail. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab a pair of these, definitely. I never seen this shoe model before. If I'm not mistaken, I want to say Supreme did like a collaboration with this model. Uh, this colorway look real trash, but yeah, they should be giving these away with a discount. These are like 50 bucks, but I need these for like $10. They got the Tinker 3s here for retail. Uh, I probably need these for like 100 They got the Pony Hair 6s for retail plus 30% off. And these definitely need to be like under 100 This is my first time seeing the Air Force One with a jewel swoosh, but got a little gray with the peach and uh, yellow swoosh. These not bad. Got a little peach clear alto. One, what they want, uh, 110 for it, plus the discount, make it like 70, 80 bucks. That's not too bad. They got fear guys at the outlets now. You already know, like this model, crazy trash then. But I'm guessing they got these for retail plus 30% off, make them like 120-ish. That's not too bad. They even got the KD-12 90s kids here for retail plus 30% off. I need, and I, I can't wait till that EYBL colorway drop, man. But in hand, He's not too bad, especially for 30% off. All right, guys, that is the end of the vlog. And it was definitely a couple of steals to be grabbed at these outlets, man. I went all around the Chicago land area and I am tired, man. But just getting to what I picked up. The first pickup was these orange AF1s. Um, I forgot, I want to say they call these the Nike Air Force One, like real tree edition. They got these in a couple of colorways. They got them in white. They got them in all like camo. I think they got like a olive green, but I was really attracted to these orange ones. I definitely had to add these to the collection. I got these for about 55 bucks, 51 bucks. Retail on these shoes is hundred bucks. So to get them for 50% off is definitely a steal. Next up is the Adidas Ultra Boost 19. Um, these are like the first colorway to drop when they released these new versions. And I always really wanted this colorway. It got like a light tan and I want to say navy or black hits with that infrared like thing in the back and just a little white all throughout the shoe. I was really attracted to these shoes, but for 180, 190, I didn't really want to get this shoe at that price. But as you've seen, they had it at the outlet 
for about like 80 90 bucks after the discount so to get ultra boost for under 100 bucks i had to go ahead and grab it so i'm glad to have gotten these in the collection last but not least i had to get the db15s um this shoe in particular like when i saw the display it didn't really say a price it just had retail but these was actually marked down to 140 bucks so 30 percent off that 140 i ended up paying like a hundred dollars for these now to get these for a hundred dollars is definitely a steal last year i got the mellow 13s for a hundred bucks that was a steal so to get db15s for a hundred bucks this is definitely a steal this is probably going to be like one of the best deals that i've gotten throughout the whole year but as always i hope you guys had a great memorial day hit that thumbs up if you like this video also comment down below what's the best shoe you've seen in this video and if you aren't subscribed to the channel what are you doing man hit that subscribe button takes nothing but a couple seconds and you'll be notified of when i drop future videos if you got any shoes for memorial day at all either at the outlets in store online comment that down below and we can talk about that too also since this like vlog is just a little bit short i've been like sitting on this footage for a long time i went to the gun range for the first time like i want to say a couple months ago like five six months ago and i did like a little bit of recording of it i didn't really know when to like put it in like one of my videos because like they be so long already but since this like outlet vlog is a little bit short i'm gonna go ahead and throw it at the end of the video also just to let you know i turned down the volume of the video a little bit because once again a gun shooting off is pretty loud already i want to like blow your speakers or whatever or make it louder than the video so i mean it's definitely loud but i had to tone it down just a little bit for this video but as always man peace and enjoy that footage in the head so many times I was straight aiming for the stomach aim for the stomach end up hitting the head but it's okay first time out not bad at all in my opinion <laughs> damage with that big gun I was aiming off for this area it had like a, a red scope on it that's why I was able to like actually see my target better but not bad for the second go around 